test is because I don't want any blurriness. They're taking a pure electric signal and sculpting it into something of beauty. Hey y'all, so welcome back to another video. Today I turned 25. Um I don't really know how I feel about it. I always told myself that I didn't want to be those type of um, people who were like, Oh my gosh, I'm getting so old. But this birthday is probably the first birthday where I actually feel, I wouldn't say different, but I feel different about my birthday. Yeah, it's just like a combination of like a bunch of feelings. Uh, of course, I'm thankful, number one. Um, but I'm also happy, I'm also a little sad, I'm also a little overwhelmed. It's like a combination of like, feelings and um i don't really know why the first quarter of my life is completed <sighs> so due to the fact that i wasn't really in a celebrating mood this these past couple of weeks i didn't plan anything for my birthday um that wasn't what i wanted to do um a year ago for some reason i was like 25 i'm just going to really do it but then as 25 started to approach i was like I really just want to be chill and so if you guys watched last year's birthday vlog that was super chill like super super chill but this year it was so chill that it was almost non-existent and that was on me i i wanted it that way because again i just had like a combination of all these different feelings so let's start from the top so on friday um i went to work as usual came home took a nap woke up did i take a nap I just basically chilled out, but my girl Sydney said she was coming over, so that's what happened. Girl, it is so dirty too, cause it's like gel on top of gel. I legit have like flakes everywhere, and I'll be at work like, please take me as I am, because you know I'm dirty. But Sydney's here. Yes. Girl, I'm telling you, this birthday is hidden kind of different. We're a quarter of a century. Not only that. Girl, don't even get me started. <laughs> I always said I wasn't gonna be like those women who complain about their age and like, oh, I'm getting older and life is down. I wasn't gonna do that, but this one kind of feel a little different. Mm -hmm. Now I'll explain later. Okay. But um, Sydney's here. She brought me a gift, y'all. Sydney is a queen of bags. I have like several bags of hers. She always gets the best bag. Happy birthday, you old woman. I know. <laughs> oh, we have a blessed 25th year. May you have continued success and collect all bags in 2020. Period. Thank you for being a great mom. <laughs> that will be crazy like 20 years from now. I yeah. show my kids like, this is the cards your auntie sent you. <laughs> and you know I did not get y'all cards. I'll be like, here's a gift card. Yeah. Yeah. You know. I appreciate it too. Am I smelling it right? Oh, yep. That's it. That's it. This smells so freaking fresh. The lace your zest. I'm about to be an exotic hoe out here. <laughs> and I've been having some crusty and dusty situations. Same. So. It's a crusty, dusty weather. Girl, wait till I show you this bruise on my thigh. Oh, boy. I ran into a desk because I'm dumb. Ooh. 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 His head opens yes. up. Girl, I'm gonna be okay. like at work. So I got her skull lip balm, and she loves skulls, as you guys can see from oh this array. Oh my gosh! And I showed oh gosh, one day, she was like, "Get that out of your room." Like I have a curse on it. I said, "No." I said, "You just gonna love it." Skulls, if you think about it, they protect your brain. So if you wanna, you know, create your own meaning for certain symbols, remember that skulls can represent protection we all have one. Oh, it's a scrub mm -hmm. i thought this was lotion mm -hmm. mad do honey mm -hmm. and turmeric and you know i'm obsessed with turmeric girl you know i've been needed girl i've been needing oh my gosh Cindy, you want some? Ooh. did you get one of these mm -mm. i said i was literally about to pick up some scrub because i've been literally i keep saying and i dusty, got you we see each other oh, we see, see each other <laughs> On Saturday, uh, me and my uncle agreed to work on the trailer for his upcoming play, Storefront. Um, I'm not sure if you guys seen the video when I did like the behind the scenes of us, well not us, but him shooting the trailer. And so basically it had to be edited. Um, I did the editing. It actually flowed really, really well. He already had like everything that he wanted written down. So he was basically like, do this, do that, do that. It was a really, really quick process. I mean, it took all day, but it was pretty quick process, so.
When did you come up with the idea for this play? When did I come up with the idea of storefront? Storefront was conceived, yeah. I was still in the post office. The rough, the rough draft of it in my head, it was more of a movie than a play, but mm. didn't have movie money, so you do play. And I could do that, but that's when it all started. Guess it kind of stemmed from uh, like the, the series Power. Mm. Power, you know, you had those bad, you knew about those that. bad characters, but uh, it was kind of be cool to have these bad characters. But let's let some of them have a spiritual awakening and seek the Lord and have a change of heart, because Power just stayed bad all the way through. <laughs> <laughs> but that's where it all came from. Yeah, this seems a little darker than what you usually do. Yeah, this is very. It's a very very dark evil sadistic but it also has like the caring part too and the loving part so even a love story that's what i wanted i kind of has a it definitely has a love story twist in it uh it has different levels of uh of discovery if you want to use that word you're going to discover a lot in it so always want to keep your audience on the edge of their seat <laughs> have them coming back without telling them everything but uh, let things just unfold. So it's one of those listening pieces too. Kind of light on the comedy. Has a little bit of comedy in it, but very light on the comedy characters. But uh, this is my dark side. He also had to do a show that night. So when he left, I basically just hung out with my cousin for a little bit. We got some food, got smoothie. No, we got tropical smoothie. And um, we just chilled. So I don't know. two things that I really, 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 really wanted for my birthday was to get my hair done. Y'all know all the natural people out there, sometimes your hair is just like, ew. You just get tired. You get tired of the look of it. You get tired of doing it. I definitely get tired of doing it. And then it gets to the point where I'm just wearing slick back ponytails every day. It's like, what good is that doing for my hair? So, and then also I feel like sometimes you just gotta do this. Sometimes I just need that in my life. And um, so yeah, I got my hair done and here's some clips from that. I went to work. I was really debating on calling out, but I didn't. I went to work. It was a pretty chill day at work. So when I got home, I hit up Sydney and I was like, hey, I want to try the new Target in Northeast DC. They just built it. So we went there. And here is some clips from that. <laughs> So the first thing I wanted was to get my hair done. The second thing that I wanted was to be off of work. I was actually going to work on my birthday because, again, I don't really make a big deal out of my birthday. It's like another day. A great day, but another day. Um, but then I just thought about it and I was like, I don't... Hi. But then I thought about it. Do I really want to answer emails and like other stuff? Like I just, do I really want to do that? So I was like, you know what, let me just call out. Well, I took the day off like a week ago. So I slept in, got some laundry done, chilled out, got some of my favorite food. <laughs> Beautiful. 
her eyes. But yeah, it was really, 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 really chill day. And now I'm actually about to take a nap. I just needed to come on here to kind of like narrate this video um, because I know it was kind of all over the place and you guys are probably watching like, is this really a birthday vlog? Your birthday is what you make it. I knew that the feelings that I was having about my birthday just wasn't a traditional celebrating type vibe. And so I didn't want to force myself to be, now the sun is coming up, after I've been taking pictures in the shadows, in the darkness all day. I didn't want to force myself to celebrate my birthday. I didn't want to have to put out energy when I wasn't necessarily feeling that way. I didn't want to have to fake the funk, basically. And so I just decided to take the super chill route and just do things that I enjoy doing, which is hang out with my family, hang out with my friends, a little bit of shopping, eating some good food, etc, etc. I am still enjoying my birthday, even though this was super chill, low key, I still enjoyed it and it was a great day today. I enjoyed myself, I enjoyed my birthday. To everybody, thank you for the birthday wishes, I really really appreciate it. You guys sure do know how to make a girl feel special. And I want to leave off this video with saying just because you don't want to have a huge party or you don't want to do anything super extravagant, don't feel bad. Celebrate the way you want to because that's what is going to be special for you. That's what you're going to look back on and say, you know what? I enjoyed that time on that day. I I enjoyed that birthday. Thank you for watching. If you're watching, please like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll, and I'll catch you on the next video. Bye. sister because she's known you all along she's gets your jokes that's very true shares your folks and she likes the same old songs not necessarily but <laughs> whatever Ooh. it'll be shipped to me and then you can pick it up thank you Kev. kevin and ebony mm -hmm. also i know i look rough right now but yes. ivory <laughs> like she couldn't even dress up for me ivory um i was supposed to pick up my gift from ivory because she's been super work because i mean <laughs> super, super, work. super busy with both Take of her two. jobs um but we we love you too ivory we love thank you ivory you. thank you so much for all the beauty love from my sisters so Mwah. i know i look terrible Wait. This light looks really good on your skin. Look that one. You're not. Oh my God! Don't. Age. I don't.